Hi guys, this is John and thank you for watching the video. Um, I wanted to share with you two quick watch purchases I recently made. Before I do that, I am wearing my Rolex GMT Master II. Black, black, black. It's the 116710LN. Anyways, watch number one, it's an Elgin. It comes in this uh, little snap case. It's definitely old. Red felt liner. No water damage. Kind of adds to the charm of the watch. It does say Elgin. I'm not sure if you can pick that up or not. A little snap case there. And the watch is yellow gold men's Curvex Elgin. And it has a, uh, I want to say the markers here are applied. It has the stylized numbers. The hour and minute hand are yellow gold. It has the uh, engravings here along the side. Railroad markers, indices around the perimeter. The side, the crown is uh, standard. I believe it's original. On the case back, we have a marker. It does show that it's base metal. And it is got a nice domed curve on there. Nice domed crystal. On the buckle, we see that is a it is a Belova. Um, leather bracelet and it is gold filled here you can see it shows 1 20th 10 carat gold filled that big money maybe a couple bucks 50 cents something like that what do you think how much do you think I paid for that for that setup right there Second watch that I recently purchased is this Gruen, and believe it or not, uh, it is ticking away. It is ticking away. I just spun it a couple times, and it is ticking away. Let's get into it. It is a two-tone. It is gold with engravings, yellow gold. I'm not sure. I mean, the color is yellow gold with engravings along the the edge uh, on the top the I guess you'd call it the bezel is silver in color it's probably steel uh, let's zoom into the dial the dial is definitely shows uh, some dirt and patina whatever you want to call it now these hours, or the numbers rather, are, are uh, stylized as well. I really like that 6, I like the 7, I like the 1s. I just like that old style. Uh, and the, the hour and the minute hands are blued. They are heat blued. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. It almost looks as if that uh, crystal is new. The crown is, eh, it's hard to tell. It's, I think it's two-tone as well. I think it's gold on the edge and silver on the main part. Base metal case back, a lot of dirt. I watched a uh, YouTube channel collecting vintage watches and he was, 
explaining how you you gotta use a brush a thick bristled brush that way when you open these case backs the dirt doesn't go in and ruin the movement uh, this watch that uh, railroad track indice is on the inside rather than on the perimeter kind of cool there are no seconds on either one of these either one of these no do not have seconds so there you have it two men's wristwatches vintage um, mechanical non quartz crystals intact little bit of gold not much this one comes in a little snap case red velvet lined I mean for the pair 10 bucks what am I gonna do with the pair I have no clue I'm probably just gonna play with them for a little bit see if I can flip them and on to the next one this is John I appreciate you stopping by and I'll see you in the next video. Please leave a comment below. Tell me what you think of these watches and how much I paid.